Well, these temperatures ought to slow those mosquitoes down tonight. 54 at 7 o'clock with sunny skies. 47, 9 p.m. and into the mid 40s at 11 o'clock. It's a chilly night on the way. Upper 30s tomorrow morning. Should be mostly sunny. There may be a few patchy clouds tomorrow morning, mainly in the northern counties. 49 degrees at noon, mostly sunny, but then the clouds return to the area in the afternoon. 53 cloudy skies at 5 o'clock. And tomorrow evening, we could even see some rain showers. Weather headlines tonight clear skies on the way. Could see some late night frost. We're getting to that time of year. Earliest recorded 32, September 22nd. The average date of the first 32 is October 22nd. Much more likely by the 6th of November to have had our first 32 degree day, as uh, we have about a 90% chance by that point. Normal lows in November will be falling off into the 30s. Increasing clouds uh, looks like uh, tomorrow afternoon on the way. We will see some light rain showers around for Operation Football, so you probably need that. That rain gear, but back to sunshine on Saturday, and a cool weekend is on the way. Lows tonight, upper 30s, low 40s around the Miami Valley. Actually, a little warmer north, where there will probably be a little more cloud cover in northern Ohio, and we should see uh, temperatures tomorrow afternoon, low to mid 50s, and then check out Saturday morning. Some late night clearing could allow some 30s and a chance for a little patchy frost once again. Goodwill Auto Auction camera, just a blue sky out there with the traffic on US 35. We're heading down to north. North Carolina, Virginia. That's where the center of Tropical Storm Michael continues to move northeast. Top winds around 50 miles per hour, heading northeast at 24. So uh, late this evening and into the morning hours, we're going to see that system head off the coast. Actually, it'll strengthen a bit once it gets out over the open waters. Live Doppler 2 HD, dry weather tonight here in our region with a cold front to the east, and you can see the clearing skies. A little patch of low level clouds up north. As I mentioned, some of that may drift south. Later tonight, but otherwise, high pressure and control of our weather pumping in that cool air. Right now in Dayton, down to 56, a northwest wind at 17, 51% the relative humidity with a barometer holding steady. Our weather checker, Scott B. Secker up in Bradford, 56 degrees. John Kingham was at 60 when he called in. And uh, Germantown area, Anna uh, looking at a 59 degree temperature tonight. So uh, finally, a return of that fall air will stay mostly clear through the nighttime hours. and Plenty of sunshine around tomorrow morning, but the clouds come in in the afternoon. You can see the green breaking out tomorrow evening. Looks like some showers passing through, but then clearing out as we get to Saturday morning, setting the stage for a cool day on Saturday, but at least a lot of sunshine around. Tonight, clear skies, chilly. Could see some of that patchy frost. A slight chance late tonight. Lows upper 30s. Winds will back off to 5 to 10. Increasing clouds tomorrow afternoon. Chance of showers toward evening. We'll get up to 54 degrees for that high. 44, 10 o'clock, 49 at noon, and 53 at 2 p.m. Back to 52 at 6 o'clock with those cloudy skies. Some light rain still possible tomorrow night, but we'll dry out Saturday. Day. Mostly sunny, 55 the high, 60 the high on Sunday. Slight chance of a late day shower with rain likely Monday. And still looking at cool weather next week. Lows in the 30s, highs in the 50s. Tuesday through Wednesday and also the chance of some frost next week. Must be fall. Well, that's okay. It looks good. It feels mm -hmm. good. Finally, it's here. We're